With a current market size of about $34 billion globally and expectations to reach over $55 billion by 2026, the drone industry is only going to get bigger. But with commercial applications being the biggest piece of the pie, what are the industries that are going to grow the fastest over the next few years and which ones should you be paying attention to? Find out more in this video. Hey guys, Dylan Gorman here. Welcome back to another video. I've been a commercial drone pilot for over 10 years, mainly focusing on drone photogrammetry and more recently have shifted into providing technical education to the space through my online platform, Pilot Byte, where you can get access to courses and workshops like my photogrammetry mastery course that just released. And you can learn more about that linked down in the description box below. So as the title implies, with the current growth that the drone industry is seeing and the pace at which large corporations are adopting the idea of leveraging drones in their day-to-day -day operations, where should you be putting your focus in if you're just entering the industry? Well, I've outlined five key industries that will see the most growth and adoption of drone technology and services over the next three to five years. So let's talk about them. The use of drones in the construction industry has exploded in recent years. With a market size of about $4.8 billion in 2019 and projections of reaching $12 billion by 2027, there's really nothing stopping drones entering and growing in this market. This growth can be attributed by the numerous ways in which drones are being used and leveraged in construction projects of all sizes, from small renovations to large-scale developments. One of the key areas where drones are having a significant impact is the ability to easily monitor and manage projects. With the use of drones, construction companies can get real-time updates on what's happening on a job site, making it easier to identify problems and take proactive measures rather than reacting to issues after they have already occurred. This can save time, money, and resources and ultimately lead to better outcomes for all parties involved. There are a few key companies that are leading the charge in the use of drones in construction, and they can be divided into two main categories, hardware and software. On the hardware side, companies like Skydio, DJI, and Velatus are developing drone-in-the-box solutions that eliminate the need for a human pilot to be present for the autonomous operation of drones on repetitive tasks. These tasks might include mapping, site monitoring, and basic inspections. For the drone-in-the-box solution, a company can deploy a drone on command or at regular intervals to keep track of what's happening on a project site in real time, allowing for instant decision-making. These solutions can be used for a wide range of purposes, such as tracking vehicles coming in and out of a project site, automating aerial survey maps to ensure that the building is following the drawings, and even doing basic stockpile analysis. On the software side, companies like Drone Deploy, Procore, and Bluebeam are providing solutions that allow construction companies to track their projects from anywhere in the world. With the ability to see a full 3D map of a project and generate reports and pull data from both ground and aerial capture, there is no reason why a construction company wouldn't want to use a software solution like this. The hardware and software solutions available are making it easier than ever to take advantage of the numerous benefits that drones have to offer. The mapping and surveying industry has been utilizing drone technology for a number of years, and it continues to be a major adopter of this innovative technology. Many firms, both large and small, have made significant investments in drones as a way to gather large amounts of data at a lower cost than traditional methods. One of the major benefits of drones in this industry is that they have evolved significantly significantly over the years. Early drones were large, fixed-wing aircraft, but now we have drones that weigh less than three pounds that are more capable than ever before. The evolution of hardware has been accompanied by similar evolution in software offerings, with the proliferation of AI being a significant role in shaping the future of drone services. The recent release of drones like the DJI Mavic 3 Enterprise and sensors like the Rock Robotic R360 demonstrate just how far the hardware and software used in drones has come. These technologies are more affordable than ever before, and they offer a wide range of capabilities that were simply not possible a few years ago. In addition to hardware and software advancements, the rise of AI has also had a major impact on mapping and surveying industry. Advanced algorithms for feature extraction enable tasks like planimetrics, volume reports, and topographic survey to be automated, saving surveyors time and money. Companies like Airworks, Drone Deploy, and Pix4D offer solutions that enable real-time use of aerial data for surveying purposes, allowing surveyors to focus on solving bigger problems rather than spending days or weeks capturing and processing data in the field. Overall, drones have revolutionized the mapping and surveying industry, making it faster and more efficient than before. Whether you are a large engineering firm or a small surveying company, drones offer a cost-effective way to gather and process data, enabling you to complete projects more quickly and accurately than ever before. 
Agriculture has long been at the forefront of automation and technology adoption. Companies like John Deere have utilized computer automation in GIS systems, as well as satellite imagery and basic drone data capture to improve efficiencies in crop monitoring and harvesting. As a drone service provider entering the agriculture industry, it's important to understand the hardware and software solutions available. One such hardware solution is DJI, which has established itself as a leader in the agriculture sector. The DJI Mavic 3 Multispectral and Agris T40 drones enable efficient, automated crop monitoring and prescription spraying of pesticides, offering capabilities that go beyond what satellite imagery or fixed wing crop spraying plans can achieve. In addition to hardware, software platform like Solvi and TerraView make it easy for farmers to get a comprehensive view of crop health. These AI powered tools allow farmers to train algorithms to detect infected plants, dry soil, low crop yields, among other issues. By leveraging drones in these software solutions, farmers can efficiently gather data and identify problem areas rather than relying on manual inspection by trained individuals. This helps to save time and improve crop yields. It's worth noting that while automation and technology have greatly improved efficiencies in agriculture industry, it's important for drone service providers to be careful and understand the regulations and requirements of operating in this space. Government agencies are paying closer attention to how and where food is being produced and it's crucial to utilize the best technology and practices to ensure the safety and quality of our food supply. The global food as a service market is currently valued at around $3 billion and is expected to reach $9 billion by 2030. Major players in this market include John Deere, Tremble, Precision Hawk, and IBM. So really a great time to enter this market as a commercial drone pilot. Drones and infrastructure have become an increasingly valuable tool in this industry helping to improve efficiencies, reduce costs, and increase safety in a variety of tasks related to infrastructure inspection, surveying and mapping, environmental monitoring, and security. In the transmission and distribution industry, drones are used for tasks such as inspecting transmission lines for signs of damage or wear, creating accurate maps of transmission lines for maintenance planning and asset management, and assessing the extent of damage to transmission lines in the event of a failure or other issues. Using high resolutions and even LiDAR systems have greatly impacted the safety of field workers inspecting these lines. Rather than spending weeks infecting a few dozen poles, you are now able to do that in a few hours. In the oil and gas industry, drones are used for tasks such as inspecting pipelines, oil rigs, and other oil and gas infrastructure for damage or maintenance needs, creating detailed maps of oil and gas sites, and planning the layout and design of infrastructure. Technologies like GPR and laser methane detection sensors play a huge role in worker and public safety. The oil and gas industry is one of the most unforgiving ones, and putting a drone in harm's way is far more favorable than a human life. With GPR, you are able to do a line location, find sinkholes, and even random anomalies underground that you wouldn't be able to find with traditional methods. And with the technology that exists today, both hardware and software, it's so much easier to put a drone in some of these really rigorous tasks, and they are now excelling and going beyond what most human capabilities are. The final industry that we're gonna cover is the inspection industry. This is one of those industries that you need to keep an eye out for. Although it doesn't have a sexy look and feel to it, it's probably one of the most important industries that drones will play a huge role in as the data collection methods have gotten more rigorous, but the drones make that process a breeze. There are a few leaders in this space when it comes to the data processing, analytics, and visualization of drone data that make it easy for all parties involved to have a full detailed understanding of the inspection at hand. Companies like Raptor Maps and QII have figured out how to mesh photogrammetry models into a super powerful AI-driven platform that makes it super easy to pull all kinds of reports out of. Raptor Maps, mainly focusing on thermal inspections for solar panels, have figured out how to seamlessly ingest high-quality thermographic orthomosaics into their cloud platform and automatically detect and annotate anomalies at large scale in a matter of hours rather than taking weeks of time from field workers manually inspecting solar panels one by one. Another platform making huge strides is QII. They are a market-leading AI platform that automates critical infrastructure inspections. Again, the name of the game in all of these industries is digital twin recreation with a large focus on creating useful data for specific industries' needs. Within QII's platform, it allows for remote inspection to view 3D assets in the cloud without having the need to send someone in person to view the object. Additionally, they also allow for multiple data sets to be layered on top of each other, such as thermal, LiDAR, and even sonar data which just enriches that digital twin model even more. What's also pretty neat about QII is their auto detection machine learning algorithm. 
where it quickly can detect anomalies or issue areas on a project site without the need for human interaction. QII offers so much more, but the root of all of this data mainly stems from drone photogrammetry. One of the last industries that I'll touch for inspections via drones is asphalt reporting. Atlas 10, a company who I've done a considerable amount of projects with, is a perfect example of leveraging drone photogrammetry in a more efficient manner to do remote inspections for. With over 200 projects that we've delivered to them, they've been able to provide a detailed holistic report of both small and large parking lots, some the size of over 4 million square feet, and it all came from the orthomosaic model my team and I was able to provide to them. The biggest reason why companies use services like Atlas 10 was it allowed for them to get a full detailed report of their asphalt condition and get up to five years of a treatment plan with estimated costs of repair and even replacement. This allows for commercial real estate companies plan better for the future, but also save tens of thousands of dollars that a typical asphalt consultant would have charged them to just get a quote. Companies like Atlas 10 are the biggest reason why drones are going to be used more and more in the inspection industry. If all these different uses for drone photogrammetry excites you and you want to learn more about how to produce drone photogrammetry models, I have plenty of free videos on my channel. Additionally, I have a full course online that you can get now, which is linked down below. And if you want to join me at one of my workshops that I'll be hosting all over the US this year, be sure to look at my current schedule where you will be able to get hands-on training with drones like this and get my online course for free. So if you've enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like. If you want to see more from me in the future, be sure to subscribe. And if you want to keep this conversation going, drop something down below in the comment section below. I'd love to talk with you. And with that being said, I will see you guys in the next one. Ooh.